Hi students, in the previous recorded session, we discussed about the recitation of the poem. In this class, we shall be dealing about the explanation of the poem, The Tree, written by K. K. N. Daruwala. Who has written the poem? K. K. N. K. E. K. I. K. K. N. Daruwala. D. A. D. A. R. U. R. U. Daru. W. A. L. L. A. Wala. Okay. K. K. N. Daruwala. Students, how many stanzas are there in the poem? Two. One, two, three, four, and five stanzas are there. Whenever you read a lesson, we call it as paragraphs. Whenever you are going through a poem, it is known as stanza. See here. Example, you just okay. You take this lesson. See here. This is a lesson. You can see the paragraph. One paragraph, two paragraph, three paragraph, four paragraph, five and six paragraph. So, जब भी आप कोई lesson पढ़ रही, तो lesson में उसे paragraph बोलती, जब भी आप poem पढ़ रही, उसे stanza बोलती. So, in this poem, how many stanzas are there? There are totally five. Five stanzas. Okay, they are totally five stanzas. You have to understand. In the last session only, I told you, uh, have I said you about the difficult words that you have to go through that one, and you have to put the words in practice so that you improve your language. Students, now we shall look for the uh, explanation. Page number twenty-eight. Next to the track beside our house, Dad planted a gulmohar. Like when you go to a garden or when you go for an evening walk in the garden, what do you see, children? We see many plants, trees, slides, playing things, and everything, isn't it? Now, mostly you see greeneries around you, and also you see the small plants, the medium-sized plants, and the Big big trees and the big big trees, isn't it? Name some, uh, name few trees, children. Trees like yes, or else uh, in your home also few people will plant trees like mango tree, guava tree, or jamun tree, isn't it? You can see many trees. Even while you travel in the bus, you see many trees around you, isn't it? And I also told you why trees are important. So here. Next to the track beside our house, Dad planted a tree, a gulmohar. Gulmohar is nothing but is a type of a flower. See, G U Y A G U L M O H O gulmohar. Which is a gulmohar tree. We tended it, we watered it. It wanted more and more. A chota sa pauda uno lago apne ghar ke baju mein plant karte. Usse bache uski dekhbhal kar sakte. Like what does a tree want from us? It only wants care. That's it, no? And water. If we care the plant, if we uh, water it properly, it will grow big enough to give you food, to give you fruits and flowers. We tended it. We watered it. It wanted more and more. Who planted a tree? Dad planted a tree. Which tree? Gulmohar tree. Okay. When first its little shoots of green spread across the bow, you might have seen जब आप कोई छोटा सा पौधा या तो फिर बीज ला को डालती, वो छोटा like it become like this first, isn't it? It will come like this. So ये बड़ा हो को एक tree बनता है. So इसके shoots क्या थी? Green color में थी. So it will be green color. It comes out like this and Then later on grows to such big tree, okay? And some of us said, "Wow, like इतना छोटा सा plant अगर बाहर है तो हम लोगों को क्या लगता है? बहुत अच्छा लगता है, right? We feel like as if we just imagine you are having that thing, like आपने oh you go and say to your parents also, 'Mama, I had plant, I have shown a seed and it has come out.' Just see, you feel so happy, isn't it? Like that. Here the children are very happy because." Now if it is like this, so you can then show it up like it will come like this, isn't it? So it will come like this. 
and ye chota hota what it will be very much small isn't it aisa rehta kya hota aisa ho jata ye bahut chota hota hai so if branches were so low the we throw the goats away and the cows agar ye chote chote hai to kya karte the cows and goats they may eat this one isn't it they may eat the plant so the children they draw away hey hey bolko hakalte kisko janwaron ko so who are the animals mentioned in the poem sorry which are the animals mentioned in the poem very good that is cows and goats if we don't shoo away the cows or the goats what would they do they may eat the plant agar humne unko hakala nahi to kya hoti ye chote chote plant ko kya karti kha leti it really kept us on our toes a baby tree needs a care see here the tree is very small it's like a very small plant and the children had to take care of the plants for that reason people like wo bachche the to bahut zyada fikrmand the ki no we really had to take care of the plant so that it may turn into a big tree the children took care of the plant ek ek chote plant ki hifazat karte okay next year the green fuzz changed the leaf changed to leaf it turned into red roofed tree see here the poet is calling red roof the gulmohar is red color flower dekho ye ye aisa ho jata red color so aise kya bol rahi poet it is calling this as red roof रूफ इज नथिंग बट छत को बोलती लाइक आपके घर में रूफ है रूफ किसे बोलती छत को बोलती सो द पॉइंट इज कॉलिंग दिस ये दिस एज ग्रीन रेड रूफ वॉट इट इज कॉलिंग एज रेड रूफ सो हियर द पॉइंट इज कॉलिंग दिस एज रेड रूफ बिकॉज इट हैज टर्न इन टू अ रेड कलर फ्लावर इट हैज टर्न इन टू अ रेड कलर फ्लावर a thing of beauty there see when you have a tree like this when you have a tree like this it's like you really feel that you want to take care of it and when you have take you have when you have taken care of the tree when you have taken care of a plant it has grown into a big tree and now it it's looking like a red roofed tree it's looking like red roof tree so it looks very beautiful isn't it see how beautiful it's looking it's attracting the eyes so it's looking very very beautiful it never spoke to us of course do the plants or do the trees speak to us no they never speak to us it just spoke to winds see here how beautiful it's describing kaisa bol rahi hai poet bol rahi hai ki wo humse baat nahi karte balki sirf hawaon se baat karte hain how does the poetry can speak to a wind kaise baat kar sakti just imagine kaise yes and now then the wave to the skies but it gave us everything how does a tree speak to the wind when the wind comes when the wind comes and touch the tree jab hawa ko is aap chuti to kya hota hai plant idhar se udhar hilta hai isn't it lehrata hai patte hilti hai uske so in that way poet bol rahi ki ye tree jo hai sirf aur sirf hawaon se baatein karte the jab bhi hawa ko iske upar ये प्लांट से लगती तो पत्ते क्या होते हिलते इट गेव अस द फ्लावर्स एंड इट शेड इट कवर्ड दे कवर्ड हाफ द ट्रैक इट शेल्टर्ड अस फ्रॉम सन एंड रेन द ट्री हैज स्पेड बैक इट्स फॉलिंग फ्लावर्स इन शेड जब भी द ट्री इज दैट इट गिव्स द फ्लावर क्या देती फूल देती एंड जब भी बहुत ज्यादा धूप रहती तो हम कहां जाकर बैठते ज्यादातर अगर ट्री रहे तो ट्री के नीचे जाकर बैठते क्यों बिकॉज इट गेव देड छाउ देता है देता है कि नहीं जस्ट सोचो कि कहीं जा रहे हैं बाघ तमाशों को जाते हैं या तो फिर आप कहीं घूमने गए हैं वहां पे बहुत ज्यादा पेड़ हैं तो आप क्या करती हम जाओ ओह वी रियली हैव टू सिट इट बैठ जाते सो इट्स गिविंग इज द शेड ऑल्सो इट शेल्टर इज फ्रॉम सन एंड रेन लाइक आप कहीं गाड़ी पे जा रहे होते हैं कि इमेजिन करो कि यू आर गोइंग ऑन अ बाइक ठीक है suddenly it starts raining what will do we'll stand under the tree see it's protecting us from both rain and sun it protecting us from rain and sun it is
protecting us from rain and sun. The tree has paid back. See, जब भी हम कोई tree एक छोटे से पौधे को उगाते हैं, तो in turn it gives us more and more. See, it not only protects us from rain and sun, but it also gives us pure oxygen, isn't it? अगर trees नहीं बोले तो you won't be having the, we won't be having a, we won't be having yes a proper environment which can support us so in the next class we shall discuss more about the poem if you have any doubt you can just contact me through whatsapp so that i can solve your doubts but actually here the poem ends we saw here how a small plant is changed into a big tree which gives us flower and which also protect us from sun and the shade who planted the tree actually it was planted by the father okay children any doubt if you have you can just contact me through whatsapp till that one stay home stay blessed bye bye